guys! So today I am doing a collective fashion try-on haul. I've never done one of these before, but recently I've gotten a lot of really cute items that I've just been dying to show you guys. Some of these you might have seen already. I know I've worn one of these shirts in a video before. Actually, I think I've worn two of these shirts in different videos. And I've been wearing all of these in my just everyday life. They're super cash, they're super me. Which leads me to say, if you are somebody who likes to wear a lot of color, then this is just not your collective try on haul. This, this isn't for you. Nah, I'm just kidding. I like to think of myself as minimalistic, and I definitely have a theme to my clothing. I wear a lot of neutrals, I wear a lot of black, also rosy tone stuff is mixed in. In my haul, all the stuff that I have, they all are special in their own way. There's a couple that are just basic things in there. But for the most part, they all have some texture, or some detailing or just something cool about them. So I think this is overall a pretty interesting group of items. So without further ado, let me show you my items. Sit back, grab a snack, and let's haul on. Let's just haul on home. We're gonna haul right on into that sunset. Let's haul. Okay. <clears throat> All right, so my first item that I have, I am actually wearing Currently, I got this sweater from Nordy's. It is from BP brand. This is just a really cute gray soft and snuggly sweater. This is a perfect basic. I love the neckline. It's very casual, yet you can dress it up or down, whatever you're feeling, whatever you're doing. This is a great item. And also, it's super warm for the winter months. It's good to layer. It's just a good basic to have in your closet, so there's my first item. Next! So my next item that I got, you guys are going to be like, Lauren, stop being so extra. This is just your average basic hoodie, but in my opinion, I don't think it's average and I don't think it's basic. I got this from Topshop and it's just really cute. It's got a hood, it's got these tassels. <laughs> It's a basic hoodie, what more can I say? But it's so soft and I just love the look of it. I feel like it has more going on with it than just your average hoodie, but maybe not. I'm not really a hoodie girl because usually hoodies always have some type of logo and they remind me of my school, so. Oh. I'm just joshing. This is really cute. I just like the sporty look and it's well made, so I know it'll last me for a long time. My next series of items that I have coming up are all from American Eagle, and they just had a big sale recently, so I picked up a bunch of items. I don't know if they'll all still be available because they were on an extreme sale. They're trying to get rid of their winter stuff, so if they are, I will link them down below so you can find them for yourself. I'm really obsessed with these items. So my first item from there that I got is a bomber jacket. Before I got this big haul of stuff, I didn't have one bomber jacket, which I know that's so unlike me because they're super on trend right now. This was originally a hundred dollars. I got it for 20, you guys. I got it for 20. Same with my other jacket that I'm going to show you in a sec. I just really like the dark green felt. I also really liked the faux leather sleeves. Just thought that added some pizzazz. But this is really heavy weight and it's really warm. So that's very ideal, especially in these cold, frigid winter months. Really cute. It's a good item to have. Next, this could possibly be my favorite thing out of the whole bunch. It just speaks to me on so many levels. The next jacket that I got is another bomber jacket. It is the coolest, fuzziest little jacket that you have ever seen. This is cropped, it's so soft. I just really like the zipper detail on the pockets and just the zipper itself. And it's a little thinner than the other jacket that I showed you. So it's a good jacket to have that's not necessarily a parka, but still adds some warmth. So this has been one of my favorite items recently. I've worn and loved it so much this month. Next, we are getting into some color here, people. I know you're gonna be excited. Maybe, maybe not. I also got this peplum long sleeve shirt from American Eagle that in the back, it's like a crisscross and it has a little tie all open back. The side sleeves are slit open and they have some bell sleeves going on in the bottom here. This is just really cute to dress up or down. I thought it would look really cute with a fedora hat and some black jeans, some black booties. 
You know me. I can't wear all color, people. I just really like the pattern. I like the color. I thought it was different. Added a different kind of flavor into my wardrobe. Next, I love how American Eagle stuff is so soft. The next thing that I got from American Eagle is this v-neck cami that has lace detailing in the front and also in the back. They look identical, I know. It's just so soft and flowy. I love the color. And I don't think I own anything that has like this lace detail and you could wear it in so many different ways. And my last item that I got from American Eagle is this bralette. This is like a bandeau type bralette and in the back it's all see-through lace so I thought that would be really cute with an open back sweater. I also just really like how the neckline is straight across. I just really love the lace detail on it. I thought it was so cute. So trendy. The next few items that I got are from Express and a couple of these are extreme basics but they're necessities in your closet. First thing that I got that I've been wearing a ton recently is just this plain black bodysuit and I just really like the neckline. I think it's really flattering and it looks good. I like how the back it dips down and at the bottom it snaps in place so that's very helpful. You don't have to undress yourself just to go to the bathroom. So this is a great basic. Next I got from Express this high-waisted bodycon black skirt. I just really like the looks of this. I thought you could really dress it up or down. Just a little black skirt and it goes below your knees. I like the high-waisted aspect. It's really comfortable t-shirt material. And the last item that I got from there, I have worn in a video already. This is just this really cute blouse that has a cutout in the front. I also really like the sleeves of it. I thought that was really cute. In the back, it's all open. At the very bottom, it ties in a bow and I thought that was super cute all open back except the bow part. So adorable. It makes me feel so fancy. Next up, this item I got from The Gap. I would say The Gap, but it's actually just Gap. This is kind of a boring item, but it's just one of those classics, you know? So I just got a plain black oversized sweater. This is super comfortable. All black, just plain, but it's super soft. I hate when sweaters are itchy. That's the worst ever. So I got this in an extra large so it would be oversized. I really like the looks of that. And my last two clothing pieces that I got are from PacSun. The first one that I got I wore in my Winter Trends lookbook. But this is just a rosy shade cropped sweater. And this is just really soft and plush and fluffy and stretchy. <laughs> I just thought it would be really cute with that bomber jacket that I showed you. The fuzzy one looks really cute with this and a necklace. And I just like the color. It's really comfortable. And my last item that I have from them, I'm so obsessed with. It's this dusty pink mock neck cropped sweater. And I just like the knit of it. I like how it has this detail going down. I like the mock neck. It's not a full on turtleneck, but it's still got something, something going on. This is from the Kendall and Kylie collection and it just goes with everything. It's so comfortable. Highly suggest. And my last item is a pair of shoes. I got these from Macy's on sale. Your girl likes her sales. They're not really a winter shoe, I'll admit. I'm just thinking ahead. I'm thinking forward to the springtime when it's warm. I thought these would be so cute with dresses because they kind of come up a little bit on your ankle. So it's not like one of those things where you're wearing a dress and then you have some twig legs and then a huge foot. I struggle with that, so maybe you do too. I just thought these were a really great color. I love the lace-up detail. They zip up on the back so they're easy to get on. And I just love the chunky heel at the bottom. I thought that was super cute, but I thought they were worth a mention. So, yeah. So thank you guys so much for tuning into today's video. I hope you guys like this type of video, and if you do, give it a thumbs up and I might do more. Don't forget to subscribe if you're into seeing all of this, and I will see you in my next one. Goodbye!